it's terrible, you know, the, the most horrific thing that is put against the, the women followers of Dionysius was that they devoured their children at the height of their frenzy. I mean, this is a human crime for which, so far as I know, there is not even a name in English. I mean, it, it must be, uh, I can't even create it. Uh, but uh, this is what we are doing. This is what we as a society are guilty of, a crime previous generations couldn't even conceive of. It's the absolute apotheosis of dominator fury. And that's why, you know, you want to talk about real life stuff and ecological crisis. Uh, in the midst of the effort to save the rainforests, which as we all know are terribly damaged and endangered, uh, the dominator mentality has conceived a plan to aerially drop herbicide onto the Amazon in order to wipe out coca plants. So this is like, you know, you cannot trust the dominator style not to go psychotic here at the end. I mean, they have, may have to surround the place and lay siege to it. And the question is, who are they? Who is it who has the power to pry the dead fingers of the dominator culture from the instrumentality of power? Uh, this, is, this is why the chaos which is rising in the world is, it is literally the Gaian fury. It is a moment of opportunity. Everyone should understand this, that chaos provides opportunity for commandos of the new persuasion to rush forward and jam vital machinery of the dominator uh, metaphor. So the key, uh, the key to a correct political stance in a situation of chaos is to be alert to opportunity because it will come. The whole thing is advanced incrementally by people who are always aware of the possibility that the next moment will be the one in which to take a, a step forward.